Maybe you better stay in the car. We're partners, remember? Wherever you go, I go. Come to see Gordy Kramer. Kramer? The big wig tycoon from Kramer Construction? No, his son. You think maybe he's the origami killer? For now, I just have a few questions that need answers. Stupid to bring Lauren. I don't do partners too well. All that just to get my hands on that stupid old man. another time. Are we gonna be here long? This place gives me the creeps. I'm gonna go find Gordy Kramer. You stay here till I come back, okay? Okay, just let me know if you need me. Booze, babes, and coke. Gordy Kramer seems to be quite the party animal. Okay, gotta find Gordy Kramer. Don't know why they have that goddamn music so loud. Can't hear myself thinking. I'm looking for Gordy! Have you seen him? Hey, good looking girl. Keep your mind on the job, Scotty. Hi! Great party, huh? Hi! <laughs> Hi, how are you? Well, let's get better acquainted, pal! <laughs> does have a spurt. Now I got me a new friend. Have you seen Gordy? Sorry, no. Gotta find Gordy Kramer. Hey, man, you think you could help me out? Do I look like a dealer? Get out of here! I haven't seen Lauren for a while. Better see what she's up to. Beat it! I ain't for sale! If 
I want to see Gordy Kramer, I'm going to have to go about it some other way. Whoa! You see that guy over there? Do you know what he said about you? What he say? Gordy must be up here somewhere. Shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> Mr. Kramer? Shh! This is the best part! <laughs> My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. I'm investigating the case of the origami killer. I'd like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> I'd like to know exactly what happened to little Joseph Brown. Beat it! You hear me? Get the hell out of here! What do you want? A witness saw little Joseph Brown get in the back of your limousine. That was the last time anybody ever saw him. Now I know you've been arrested and interrogated until your father made a little phone call and the file was closed. I'd like to hear your version of the facts. The kid was lost. I just offered to drive him home. The police arrived, I explained the misunderstanding, and I was released. End of story. Nothing to get excited about, right? I don't know why, but your story just doesn't check out. You're giving me the crap now. Tell me something I can't believe. Very well. I'm the origami killer. I get my victims into my car. I drown them in rainwater. Then I dump them on a wasteland with an origami figure in one hand and an orchid on their chest. I do that because I'm bored, Mr. Shelby. And it's a creative and entertaining way of Having fun. Is that good enough for you? Or do you want more? This interview is over. Get rid of this clown! It's a dangerous game you're playing, Kramer. Do you know who my father is? 
He only has to lift one finger and you won't wake up tomorrow morning. You're the one that should be afraid, Mr. Shelby, not me.